get a chance to play in your first ever National Hockey League playoff game, and I had to look down to make sure that was the truth. You've been around here for so long. Uh, how excited are you to, to get the chance, and I'll, of course, uh, go to Boston to do it? Oh, really exciting. I think, uh, I think that's how we worked all, for all season to get in the playoff and to get uh, an opportunity to win. And, uh, no, I'm just really excited, ready to go, and uh, excited to see what it's going to be like. Your former World Under-18 champion, World Under-20 champion, you won a Quebec championship and got to the Memorial Cup. Uh, you've played in big games. Are all those experiences important in helping you uh, with this experience this spring? I think so. I think every time you win or you go through a long you know, playoff run, uh, there's a lot to learn from. Uh, but no, I'm mostly how to prepare, how to take care of yourself. I've been through it in the past and I know how to take care of my body. But of course, in the NHL, it's a higher pace, higher level, higher intensity. So it should be fun to, to, to get uh, to play in that game and uh, see how it is. 70 games this season plus three and uh, you get three goals as well. Are you happiest with your consistency this season at this level? Oh, uh, yes, I always think it could be better, but I think uh, I'm taking a step in the right direction. I think I've been uh, more consistent than I've been the year before, so I just got to work toward that and uh, keep being more and more consistent. A big day today. Uh, the, a woman in your life turns one. A happy birthday to Stella. Yeah, it was yesterday, actually. So, no, no, it's great. She uh, she turned one yesterday, baked her a cake, and uh, she ate half of it. So, no, it was great. It was great. So, uh, it's always little fun memories I'm going to keep.